Dave Heidel, the marketing manager for the UAS group of AeroVironment. And today we're going to be talking about our products. We're going to start with our family of system. You see on display here, the top one is Puma. And the Puma has an uh, endurance of about two hours in the standard configuration. Uh, with an extended range battery, it'll go a little bit over three hours. It has the ability to fly out about uh, 15 kilometers and weighs about 13 pounds. It has a gimbal camera on it, which means it's very easy for the operator to control and, and uh, target in on what he'd like to view. Next one down is the Raven, the real workhorse that the Army uses. Uh, it has a range of about 10 kilometers, weighs 4.2 pounds, and will fly for about uh, an hour and a half. And it also has a gimbal camera on it. The bottom one you see is the Wasp. This will fly about 50 minutes, has a gimbal camera on it, weighs 2.2 pounds. Uh, we call it a family of systems because it operates with a common ground control station. At the bottom here you see a backpack and that backpack is actually what the Raven comes in. It's packaged in that and that's how it's carried. And all these um, aircraft are hand launched, uh, don't require any type of infrastructure to operate, land on ground, uh, and the Puma as well as the Raven, I'm sorry, the Puma and the Wasp are all environments so they can land in water. Now, we just, we just released Monday of this week the Puma. We released a solar power version of that, which actually allows it to extend from three hours to nine hours, over nine hours. The test flight was nine hours, 11 minutes and 45 seconds.